All right, just going to make this quick video for people that are having uh, NAT issues with their Xbox Live. Um, after you log into your router and you want to change the router settings so that you can allow Xbox Live to communicate better through the internet, um, just log into your router. And once this is up, <coughs> there's a few settings that I changed to uh, op help optimize it. One was the uh, firewall settings, the DMZ. I uh, went and got the IP that the Xbox is using. Uh, you can do that through the uh, Xbox network settings. You can find the IP address and then just en en enable the DMZ if you have this on your router. And uh, just put in the IP. <coughs> and the for the NAT settings, port uh, forwarding you want to set up uh, the IP address uh, for the ports and you want to open up ports 88 and uh, 3074 port and do that for both uh, TPC and UDP and once you set all those up um, that's pretty much it you're ready to go and uh, just to give you a quick look on them settings uh, for what I did for this uh, SMC Networks router. Um, just select your UDP or TPC, put in your IP address, and uh, leave that remote IP to any, and then single port, write in your port on the start port and the private port here. I think you have to do this just for it to take, and then just click apply, and then do that for um, both the TPC and UDP. You could try both, that might work. I decided to do them separately. I'm not sure if it makes a difference or not. Okay, and that's it. Hope you uh, enjoy the video and I hope it helps.